Hey guys, and welcome back. It's Grant Burgess from The Strength Code, and today I want to talk about the importance of having a coach. If you like the video, please like and subscribe to the channel. If you have a barbell coach, your lifting will go better. No, dead serious. I can hear you. I can hear you. Here's Grant again, trying to sell me some product, memberships to his gym, online coaching. Um, yes, that is true. I'd also like to sell you some plates with that product, but no, seriously, having a, a coach makes, having a gym is important, having a coach makes a big difference. And here's why. Having a coach holds you accountable. And really, that's all it is in the long run. In the short run, I'm going to coach you how to do these movements. I'm going to teach you how to do the basic barbell movements of the squat, the press, the bench press, the deadlift, how to do chin-ups, all that stuff. And then in the longer term, as things get harder, I'm gonna give you programming recommendations. Hey, we're gonna do five by five over here, or actually read that article, or we're gonna do a set of eight over here or a triple over here, and all of that stuff is really helpful. In the long, long run, what it is, is you are paying to hold yourself accountable. You're paying to know that someone is going to think about what you're supposed to do and they're gonna have some type of feeling about you if you don't do it. To my clients, you know who you are. Now, the argument can be made that a coach is important just because the vast amount of knowledge they have, and it's true. If you've done this in a commercial setting for any amount of time, you, you've gotten better and you know more and more things. I mean, I've seen so many things happen in my gym, bad things, good things, this type of injury, that type of injury. So the person's gone through the process of fixing all of these things and they can tell you when something flares up exactly what to do. But if the coach is really good or worth their salt at all, they're actually going to kind of coach themselves out of a job in terms of technique and programming because they should be explaining to you why they're doing the things that they're doing. And therefore, in the long, long run, the purpose or the goal or the reason that a coach is so effective or people that have coaches lift longer is because it keeps them accountable. And I'm not talking about you wouldn't lift anyway. What I'm talking about is someone that's constantly pushing you. So one, they push you to make sure you go to the gym or they make sure you work out on your own because they're writing your program and why would you throw money away? Maybe it's a psychological thing you're using for yourself, but I'm talking that push you. I still remember when I first deadlifted 575, I actually forget, and I hit a PR and I texted Mike, a fellow coach of mine, hey man, just hit this weight. And he was like, cool, I just did 600, blah, blah, blah. I sent him the video, he's like, you could have done 580. I'm like, what? But then when I lift, sometimes in my head, I think like, man, I don't wanna do a set of two or three and send it over to Mike and Mike watches it and goes, you could have done five. Cannot tell you how many times in my gym, lifters walk in, walk up to me, and they tell me why they can't do something, all these reasons, and I tell them, do it anyway. Literally, that's all I say to them. No, we're gonna do it anyway. But blah, 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 blah. No, we're gonna do it anyway. Then they do it, and on the way out of the gym, thank you so much for making me do that, right? They, they, they could have done it. So there's value in that, but I really think the long-term benefit of a coach is the accountability. If you're serious about your lifting, figure out Marine Corps leadership tenant, know thyself and seek self-improvement. If you're someone that, if they don't have an agreement with someone to show up somewhere or do something and they don't do it, if that's you, then you should hire a coach to make sure that you show up and do your workout. If you're someone that, hey, when it gets hard and heavy, I'm just gonna quit, you should hire a coach so that you don't just quit and you actually get stronger. If you're someone that, well, you should hire me specifically. Anyway, if you like the video, like and subscribe to the channel. We'll see you next time.